Science Lesson 24. Welcome everybody. We're glad to see you again. Can everyone say hello? Hello. Hello. Let's get started with our meditation. Good, our meditation. You know what to do. Show me. Show me your two fingers. Find our heart center. Heart center. Good. Take a deep breath. Close your eyes. Remember your hand is open in your lap or on your desk. Try and relax your body, clear your mind. Focus your energy on your heart center. Once we're able to feel it here at our heart center, relax our other hand. We want to keep that feeling. Boom, 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 boom. Hang on to it. Take a second to check in with your breathing. Just notice as you move in. Keeping the focus at our heart center. We are feeling calm and relaxed. everyone. We'll slowly open our eyes, come out of meditation together, taking three deep breaths. Very good. Ready? Nice and slow. One. Feels good, huh? All right, up on our feet, we'll do our warm up together. All right, what do we do first? Stretch. Yep, stretch up towards the sky. Reach. Oh, very good. Yeah, we can interlace our fingers, press up, good stretch to the side. There you go, Nadia, to the side. I like it. 
All right, and then what do we do? Shake, shake, shake it up, shake, shake. Or wiggle, right, wiggle, the same thing. Show me how you can wiggle really slow. Very good, so fancy. Show me how you can wiggle really fast. Very good, good. All right, then what do we do? Yep, we stretch down towards our toes. Reach for your toes, everybody. And then, very good. We shake it out, shake, shake, shake it out. Then what? <gasps> Spin, how many times? Three times. Three times. Very good, but wait. First, I want you to hmm, spin this way and jump. Good. I'm trying to mix it up for you guys. Two. I want you to spin back this way and jump. Oh, very good. Very good. Here's a new one. Listen. Three. I want you to spin and wiggle. <gasps> what? <laughs> that was even better than I thought it was gonna be. Very good. Okay, what's the last thing we do together? Jump, jump, jump. jump. How many times? Three times. Three times. Wait, what? Oh, wait. One, I want you to jump forward on one foot. Good. Forward, one foot. Two, I want you to jump backwards on one foot. On the other foot, yeah. Good. Backwards, one foot. And three, I want you to spin and jump. Very good. Back to our seats. So today, in science, we're going to be talking about plants again. <clears throat> yeah, let me hear you say plants. 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 Good. Does anyone remember what a plant is? Anyone know? Like a, a tree is a plant. What else? Flower. Flower. Grass. Grass. Yeah. Does anyone remember? Ah, very good. Yeah, the name of some of the flowers we learned. We learned sunflower. And rose. Home. Is, home is not a plant. It, yes, lily. Lily, very good. No, the pond was the home of the plant. Pond is not a plant. What about, remember Pater called it shampoo? It's not shampoo, but it's bamboo. Bamboo, very good. Bamboo. And remember the spiky one? Ow, ow. Cactus. 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 Yeah. Many, many plants. All right, so last lesson we were introduced to the, so last lesson we were introduced to the parts of a plant, all right? Just like there's parts on our body, the plant has parts to its body as well. All right, so we're gonna first review those vocab words using our flashcards. All right, so we're gonna start at the bottom. I know, haha, <laughs> bottom. Mm -hmm. Bottom can also mean like low, same. Yeah. We're gonna start down at the toes, the toes of the plant. We call these Roots. Roots. Close. Roots. 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 Okay. It's a T S. Root. S. Roots. Roots. You could call it a sunflower, but the yeah, the part of the plant. This is the flower. Flower. The flower. 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 Yeah, it's almost like the hat or the head of the plant. Mm. Yeah, it's like the head of the plant. Flower. Or if we don't have a flower, we could have 
Strawberry. It is a strawberry, but when it's part of a plant, we call it foot. 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 No. Fruit. 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 This is the fruit of the plant. Fruit. Fruit. Okay. Stem. <gasps> Very good. What was it, Pathet? Stem. 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 It's like the center part of the plant, like the body of the plant. Stem. 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 And who remembers the word for this? Ah, very nice. Leaf. 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 Good. The leaf would be like the hands of the plant, right? Many, many leaves. Mm. Yeah, too much sun. That's right, they die. All right, so remember one leaf. One leaf. Two leaves. Two leaves. Good, it's a V sound. Two leaves. Two leaves. Good, very good. All right, and the last one, remember, is for a tree. When we have a tree, the arms of the tree we call branch. 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 Yeah, good, it's the choo-choo sound, branch. Branch. Good, it is not shh, branch, no. No, branch. 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 Good, branch. All right, so we are going to label those parts together on the board. This is gonna be the soil level. Mm -hmm. Soil. So we'll start with the flower. Very good. Oh, you guys are excellent. Good. <clears throat> so we'll start with the flower. I heard you guys saying it. Roots. Roots. Stem. 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 Leaf. 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 <laughs> Two leaves. Good. And flower. Very good. Flower. Let's focus. All right. Now let's start from the top. So this one is flower. Flower. Leaves, leaves, stem, roots, roots, roots. Good. All right. So first for our flower, we're gonna do a little rhyme together about the parts of the flower. All right. So up on your feet. I want you guys to move along with me and listen. Once you remember the words. All right. Up on our feet. Show me that you're ready. So first we'll go through it slowly. First we're gonna start, all right, that's what we're gonna say there. And then we stand up tall, good. We say the stem, the stem, the stem is nice and tall. We know tall, right? Good. And then we say the leaf, the leaf, the leaves are all around. Good, good, right? So you do one, two here, and then one, Two on the side. Like leaves. All right? And then the last thing we do is cute little flower face. So we say the flower, the flower makes it easy to be found. No, do a flower. Don't squish your face. Okay, so that's how it's going to go. So Teacher Shelby will sing it and you guys move along. So let's start down. <laughs> Ready? The roots, the roots, the roots are in the soil. Hurry! 
The stem, the stem, the stem is nice and tall. The leaves, the leaves, the leaves are all around. The flower, the flower, easy to be found. Pretty good. All right, we're gonna do it again. Back down. The roots, the roots, the roots are in the ground. The stem, the stem, the stem is nice and tall. The leaves, the leaves, the leaves are all around. The flower, the flower, easy to be found. <laughs> you guys are such cute flowers. Okay, one more time. Show me your roots. The roots, the roots, the roots are in the ground. The stem, the stem, the stem is nice and tall. The leaves, the leaves, the leaves are all around. The flower, the flower, easy to be found. Oh, beautiful. Nice work, everybody. Roots. The roots are in the ground, right? Stem. The stem is nice and tall. Leaves. Leaves. The leaves are all around. Flower. Flower. Easy to be found. Good. Okay, another type of plant. A tree. Yeah. Whoa, it's kind of weird. Yes, very good. These are so hard. <laughs> are you laughing at my tree? Yes. That's okay. I'm good with it. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. Beautiful. <laughs> Look at that one. <laughs> Whatever. You guys know it's a tree, okay? Tree. Whatever. And then it's got, let's do many, many. Leaves. What in the world? No. Like that, like that, and then like. Pretend like these are leaves, okay? And then we're gonna have some uh, all things. Yeah. Oh, that is supposed to be an apple, yes. Okay. I will add a bit of color so you guys can tell what's what. We can't see it. I'm sorry, my markers uh, are no good. You guys get it, right? So similar to our flower, right? Our tree has roots. Roots, that's right. Our tree has roots. But instead of stem, we call these branch. 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 Right? So we wouldn't say, we wouldn't say the tree has a stem. No, we wouldn't say that. We would say the flower has a stem. The tree has a branch. The flower has a stem. The tree has a branch. All right, so these are gonna be the branches. But what else is the same? A tree has leaves, leaves just like a flower, yep. And it can have a flower or a fruit. Fruit, yes, it is an apple. And on the tree, it's the fruit. It's the fruit of the tree, all right? Uh, so next, I'm gonna have you guys help me label each, all right? So, Starting over here with Hugh, and I want you guys to do this in your room as well, um, using your whiteboard. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna have, I'm gonna draw out a label, and you guys are gonna write it. Yeah, actually that's a great idea. So who knows what this is? 
Yeah, let go. Roots. Come on down and label it. Yeah, so we're all going to take turns as a class to get to label all the parts of our two plants. Here you go. So here, roots are. Hope we remember our alphabet letters. It's going to be really good practice. Good. Thank you, Leka. Roots. Roots. Here are the roots. Yeah, good. All right, so what about this? Very good. Stem. Stem. Come show me stem. Can you reach this? Too tall? All right, good. So stem is S. <laughs> Go this way, babe. T, right? We want to write this way. Always, here, hold this. Let me show you. So when we're writing our letters, I, I'm sorry, we haven't specifically addressed this. We always write from this side, this way, right? We always write this way. Let me show you. So we write A, B, C, right? We always go this way. Always when we're writing. We don't write A, B, B C, D, right? We do not, we don't go this way. All right, so S, T, E. E, 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 E. Very, yeah, that was right, that was an E. You had it right. Yeah, that's a very good E. M, M for monkey. M for monkey. One more, that's in. There you go. Yep, they sound very similar. Stem, thank you, Patha. Stem, yeah. Roots, stem. All right, so what's this? Leaf, very good, leaf. Come on. All right, Nadia, come on down. Everyone will get to go, don't worry. You all get a chance, over here. Show me leaf, it's L. Perfect. E. This way, baby. This way. There you go. Mm-hmm. A. Oak. <laughs> there you go. F. F for fish. Very good, Nadia. Very pretty letters. Leaf. The end. Thank you. Leaf. Roots. Stem. Leaf. Good. All right. Flower, Pakbun, you can have flower. We'll make it go here. You can write right here, okay? To top. All right. Flower is F. Same as this one. F. Oh, big. Right bigger. There. Perfect. L. L. L for lion. L. L. <laughs> o. Oh. 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 Oi. What happened? L. There you go. Good. All right, here's a tough one. W. W. Do you remember W? It's like M upside down. It's like this. Yes, ma'am. W. Good. E. Nice. R. R. Very pretty. Good. Thank you. Flower. Flower. Roots. Stem. Leaf. Flower. Flower. All right. Over to our tree. Roots. Very good. Roots. Roots of the tree. All right. This way. R. R. 
Mm -hmm. Here, and then go this way. Very pretty R. All right, O. O. Another O. One more time. Get S for snake. S. There you go. S. Roots. Thank you. Hi. Period. Perfect. Roots. Roots. Good. So what about these? Branch. Very good, pal. Come on down. Branch. I'll make it. I'll make it lower so you can reach it. Meow. Can you reach that? All right. H. Very good. Branch. 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 Thank you. Roots. Branch. All right. And the tree also has. What are these? Leaf. Leaf. Very good. Leaf. All right, Hugh. Come on down. Mm -hmm. Here. You can do it here, babe. Go. Yeah, there you go. Okay, ready, Q? L. L for lion. Yes. L. F. F. F for fish. F. Or F for flower. F. Very nice. Leaf. Thank you. Leaf. So on our tree, roots. Branch. Branch. Leaf. Leaves. Leaves. Good. All right, so our last one, very good, is going to be fruit. Where can we write this? Can you reach this? Cut. Come on down. You're tall. Fruit. Very good. Can you reach that? Yeah? All right, cool. F. 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 F for F for flower. Or F in leaf. F. F for. We're not writing apple, we're writing fruit. F. 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 Hmm. This is interesting. Good. T. T E. T. T E W. <laughs> yeah, like T U T E W. T. 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 Yeah. T for pot. 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 T. Yeah. There you go. Fruit. Thank you. Fruit. All right. Let's go over them again. Roots. Roots. Branch. Branch. Good. Leaf. Leaves. Good. Fruit. Fruit. Good. Stem. Stem. Good. Leaf or leaves and flower. Very good. And flower. Okay. So briefly, we're going to talk a little bit about the function or the job that each part of the plant has. All right. So it's important. Let me remind you, are plants living or non-living things? Living. Are plants living or non-living things? Living. They are living things, definitely. They grow, right? They have seeds. They reproduce. They make more. Make more. 
All right, they are living things. So we're gonna talk a little bit about the parts of the plant because it's a living thing, right? So it has to have water, definitely. It has to have, it has to have water, yeah. And it has to have some sort of food because it's a living thing to be able to grow. Are how the plants drink water. Mm -hmm. Right? There's water. There's water in the soil. And the roots drink it up for the plant. That's what the roots do. Right? There's water and the roots grab the water and minerals and drink it up. Good. It's necessary. All right? Same with the tree. There's water in the soil and the roots of the tree drink up the water and the minerals from the soil, all right? It's how the plant drinks. All right, so then we come to the stems or the branches of the tree, right? They move the water, all right? So the flower says, I'm thirsty, I need water. And the root says, I have it. So the stem says, I'll help you. Uh, so the stem lets the water travel. Now the flower gets to drink, all right? That's the job of the stem. Yeah. It's like a road to the flower so the flower can drink. Hmm? Yeah. Yeah, what happens if no water for the flower? All right. Yep. Yeah, dead on the ground. All right, so the roots soak up the water. It goes through the stem, right? So what about the leaves? What's the job of the leaves? The leaves get to catch light from the sun, right? So the leaves are in the sun. They're like, mmm, sun, right? They absorb sun. The leaves absorb the sun, right? This is how the plant makes food. I know it sounds kind of wild, but it's how the plant makes food. So it's shining. Plants like the sun, right? Shining, 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 shining. To the leaf. The leaf says, give me more. Give me more, sun. Give me more, right? So that's what the leaves do. Leaves absorb the sun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the plant can grow bigger and bigger. Good. All right, so now we're to the flower. What does a flower do? I'm gonna tell you. So the flower, very beautiful, right? Beautiful flower. Mm-hmm. What color? We use blue. Good. So we have beautiful flower. And the reason that it's so beautiful, right? The job of the flower with its pretty colors like pink and purple is so when a yeah. The bee likes the flower. Colors, right? So the, yeah, the bee sees pink and purple and beautiful and says, I want that flower. Ew. Yeah. So the bee says, oh, so beautiful. And he pollinates the flower. Mm -hmm. Yep, butterflies too. Absolutely. Butterflies too. Okay. All right. So down at the roots, they soak up the water, right? It goes up through the stem so everyone can drink it. Water goes up through the stem. Give me more. And that's how it makes food for the plant. And the flower. Its job is to be beautiful. So all the butterflies and the bees want it. They say, oh, beautiful, I want it. Go there. All right? Look at this drawing, man. 
All right, so it's similar, very similar for the tree, right? The roots soak up the water, right? So the water can go up through all the branches, the leaves. Soak up the sun. Give me more. Give me more. Right? And the fruit. The fruit attracts animals and contains a seed. We'll learn about that later. All right. Roots. Stem branches. Water goes up. Leaf. Give me more. Give me more sun. Good. And the flower. Beautiful to attract animals or insects. It's the way that they reproduce. All right, cool. So the last thing we'll do together today is a worksheet. We've got our very own strawberry plant. Strawberry. Yeah, strawberry plants are cool, uh, among other many plants, because they have flower and fruit, right? So they have both. They have flowers and they have fruit. So it's two and one, all right? So I'm gonna pass these out. Together, we're going to label the parts, stem, roots, leaf, right? Just like we practice on the board. And then you get to decorate, color in your strawberry, okay? Well, is it yours? This one's yours. We'll figure it out by process of elimination. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We'll figure out whose it is. Oh, not yours. Probably Tio. Tio never puts his name on anything. You're welcome. There you go. Called it. It was Tio's. Now that we all have a worksheet, we'll go through and label the parts together, and then you guys can color it on your own. No nickname. Yes. Yeah, definitely nickname. Please. Ooh. And then we'll do <laughs> It's fine. Don't worry about it. You guys know what I mean. All right. Pretend that looks like yours. Yeah, but it's just for the sake of labeling. Chill. Okay, so let's write them. Let's label the parts together. Let's start down here at the bottom. What are these called? What's the name? Roots. roots. Very good. So find the line that's pointing to the roots. Find the line. And on it, write roots. R O O T S. Roots. Just like that, Vaughn. Very good. Just like that, yeah. Roots. Find the one that points to the roots and write roots. Mm -hmm. Okay, we ready for the next one? So what are these called? Stem. Yep, stem. That's right, stem. So find the one that points to the stem. I don't know what side it's on for you guys. And write stem. M. Stem. Stem. The stem of the plant. The roots of the plant. Very good. <laughs> no, you're not finished yet. All right, so I want you all to finish uh, coloring your worksheet in your own class, and then you can join us back here to say goodbye. And write leaf, L, E, A, F, leaf, leaf. So fast. No, no. That's right. Leaf. So once we've got our leaf labeled, 
Pak Boon, what's this? Flower. Flower. Good girl. So find the line that points to the flower. And let's write flower. F. L. O. W. E. R. Flower. Flower. It is a strawberry, but what do we call it on the plant? Fruit. 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 We call it fruit because fruit can mean many things, like grapes, banana, watermelon, fruit. Oranges, apples, grapes, grapes, fruit. Right? It's a bit, it's a group. All right, so find the line pointing to our strawberry, and we're going to label it fruit, which is F. R U I T. Fruit. Fruit. Nice work. All right. So once you properly get the parts of your plant labeled, now I want you guys to make it look good. Add some color with your crate on. Make it a really pretty strawberry plant. Sorry, love. Very pretty. What is it? And hey guys, you can even add soil in your picture if you wanted to draw some soil, right? Down below. That would be accurate. What is it in there? Yeah. That's okay. Yeah. Yeah, it looks good. Good. And you can add soil too around here. You can add soil. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Yeah. Great work today, everyone. Hope your pictures turned out beautiful. That's gonna be the last activity for this science lesson. Can everyone say goodbye? Bye. Goodbye. Thanks, and we'll see you next time.